Okay, now we're going to roll out the dough. Kind of gentle stuff will be crumbly. I don't want it to stick too much, so we for the feel of it, I do want to lay on a little bit of flour. If you notice it's sticking, I always add a little bit more flour. Now, you may have seen empanadas in the past where they're smaller little pies. That's one way to do it. Another way is just a big pot pie, which is what we're doing today. If you notice, I have my pan over here, which is what I'm going to be cooking it on. Lost my oil. Yeah. Not quite where I want it yet. Roll it out just a little bit more. there. Now if you're really fancy, you'd go through and you'd trim it down. I'm really not that concerned. It's going in my belly. Now, I do want to use up some of the stuff that fell off and incorporate it into this. Okay, now we're going to stuff it. You want to leave a little bit of an edge because you want to seal it. Like so. Okay. Got that in there. Then from that point, here are my buttons. We get our edges ready with a little bit of egg. Wash. Maybe not. Ah. Okay, that went really well. Okay, a little egg wash, like so. You come here. There we go. Take off, take this next piece. Lay on. We'll seal this down. Get 
that nice and sealed in there. Okay, and from there, now we can actually prettyfy it. Get those rough edges out, make it look pretty again. And cover this egg wash so it'll look brown nicely. Take a fork and seal the edges, like so. Make sure it actually stays the way we want it to. blade, some slits across the top so it'll vent, and in the oven it goes. And now, if everything has gone well, you have this at the very end. The greatest thing about this is you can serve this hot or cold and be just as well off. And there we go. Our empanada.